first off, let me let me just give I want to I want to give the floor to uh, Mr. Cash right now because he is a Republican. Mm-hmm. There is a Republican president. Mm-hmm. There's a Republican Congress, mm-hmm. and so I'm sure as a Republican, even though you didn't vote for Donald Trump, you are happy, very happy, excited, yes. happier than you know if this was Hillary Clinton in a Democratic Congress. Mm-hmm. And so, first off, I just want to hear from you what you feel the future of the country will be in the next six months. I'll say in the next in the next year because of uh, of your party. I'll say next two years because that's the that's when the next uh, you know uh, congressional uh, elections will be. Uh, what do you think uh, is going to happen in the next couple of years, and how do you, how do you think the country is going to end up turning out? Well, I, I think obviously, I mean, um, President Trump's already signaled what what he's going to be doing during his first hundred days. I mean, I think he's going to be rolling back a large number of regulations that were created during the Obama administration, whether it's the Affordable Care Act or whether it's um, the the limits on overtime or you know any, anything else that the Obama administration created through executive order. So I think that's part of what you're going to see over the next. Obama hundred- is just a reg- is just a regulation to you. Well, no, I'm not. I'm not. I'm talking about the executive orders that his administration created. I mean, the, okay, the Affordable Care okay. Act is was an actual bill that Congress okay. passed. And he signed. Okay, I was just wondering because it but, seemed but, like you had grouped it together with a regulation. But, but no, <laughs> I, I mean, obviously there were there were a number of rules and regulations right, 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 that right. came out they of came the legislation. Yeah. Okay, yeah. And, I and I think a lot of those rules and regulations are going to be rolled back. I mean, I that's that's exactly the executive yeah, yeah. order that President Trump signed within five minutes of, of being inaugurated. So. I think that's what you're going to see the next six months. Um, I think that's what you're going to see the next year. Um, I think myself, along with a lot of other members of my party, are hoping that Republicans don't overreach. Um, I felt like Senator Tillis, um, in North Carolina, Senator Tillis had a great op-ed in the Charlotte Observer where he talked about that just because uh, President Trump just won the election, that doesn't mean that Republicans have a mandate. Um, I, I think that if Republicans try to interpret this as a mandate and they do overreach, um, you could see a backlash from voters in the next two years. 